This video is now brought to you by GeekRetreat.com Oh, what's up people, Dr. Wars is right here, and welcome to Pokemon Pack Openings Time. Before we start, please check out GeekRetreat.com as always, they're amazing. And today, we are going to be opening up the Hooper V-Box. Now, when I first purchased this, I thought this was going to be the last V-Box ever made. Turns out I was completely wrong, they're still carrying on with Vs, you know, with the new Brilliant Star, and all the other goodness that's coming out within the months. But I'll tell you truthfully people, I cannot wait to open this box up because like I said, it has some awesome packs inside it and I do like Hooper a lot. Tell you what was quite interesting as well, I don't know why I was thinking this, this was just me thinking it out of my head, about um, Pokemon Arceus, if you guys want to know. This is about Arceus, uh, Legends Arceus on the Switch. I thought they were going to have a bit of a story with Arceus teaming up with Hooper because you know Hooper's like, you know, teleportation to a different dimension and all that lot it could have happened but looks like they didn't do it but either way i don't mind hooper's still an amazing pokemon it's a cool mythical creature there you go there's the giant card that goes into my personal collection and then of course you get yourself the amazing standard size card sleeve that up there we go and it's gone so we got ourselves two fusion strikes one Evolving Skies and one Beautiful Vivid Voltage. And of course, for the people who do the TCG online, there's your code, and it's gone. I'll tell you what, a lot of people, a lot of people have been asking me if I was ever going to make t-shirts with, here's your code and it's gone. But, like I said, I tried to make t-shirts a while back and nobody bought them, so there was no point for me to make any more t-shirts. Anyhow, we've got one pack, as one, we've got one hollow at the moment, which is a box standard. And I feel like we're gonna start, we're gonna just go ahead and start off with Fusion Strike first off. Start with the new, end with some old. So let's hope we get some good luck today. The last um, two episodes have been all right at the moment, but let's hope our luck keeps on going. Because literally I thought my luck would run out after Celebrations, seriously people, because Celebrations Extravaganza was insane in the membrane so I am not expecting to have any massive luck this month but still I'd like to get something Frostmoth and a normal rare Blissey okay was that a normal reverse foil yep a reverse foil not a rare next pack okay that was a strong pack to be honest wow this one really does not want to open Okay, here is your code, and it's gone. One, two, three, four. Let's have a look. We've got almost a leaf energy. Marsh Dom. Cross, si cross receiver? Cross receiver, I meant. That's not how it. Semi Sage, Shelder, Volto, Pan Sage, Cuffant, Glygla. A reverse for a crawfish. Oh, very nice! We get ourselves the Greninja V card. I'll take that. I love Greninja. He was my starter in um, Sun and Moon. One of the best starters out there. I really do love it. It definitely does rival with the original classics like Charizard, Blastoise, and Venusaur. But still, an awesome Pokemon to come out of a very poor Pokemon game that people hated, but I liked. <laughs> Evolving Skies, like I said, Evolving Skies has not been very kind to me, They've, this set has really never given me anything good, except for the same stupid duplicate of Espeon, and I don't want another Espeon, I really don't, just give me something, please, please I'm begging you, Metal Energy, Fletcher Linda, Blue Turn, Spirit Mask, Gossip Floor, Feebass, Hippopotamus, Lilip, Nickit, nice, we got ourselves a reverse for a rare Moltres, and a normal rare Altair. Mm, come on! Still evolving sky still does not love me. Oh boy. But it's alright, we do have Vivid Voltage. Vivid Voltage was very nice to me last month and the month before with celebrations. Having us pull a full art. Pikachu, VMAX, 
Not the ghost rare, I mean, not the um, rainbow rare, but the main full art, which was un freaking believable. Can we do this again? Water energy, Rocky Helmet, um, the Pirates Reel, <laughs> Crocodile, uh, I mean, Croc Croc Croc, uh, Chinchillo, Ninkada, Voltorb, Rock Rock, Wisma, Reverse Foil Sableye, and a Garbodor. That's what that pack was absolute garbage. <laughs> Either way though, I cannot complain, like I said, it is only a 4 pack box, you probably would guarantee, hopefully, a holo rare, which we did, we get ourselves a normal V card, which was nice indeed, but either way, let's see what we pulled today for our reverse foil rare, for our reverse foils, we've got ourselves Sableye, Quillfish, and Frostmoth. For our reverse foil rare, we get ourselves the Galarian Moltres reverse foil rare, and for our main hitters of the day, we got ourselves our V Greninja and Hooper V. If you guys enjoyed it, I surely did. Make sure you smash the like button as always. Please check out geekretreat.com. They are amazing as always. And like I said, if you guys are into your Pokemon or Yu-Gi-Oh tournaments, drop on down there and try and join the tournaments. I've been doing the Yu-Gi-Oh and I've been doing alright with it. Not as I was back in the day, but still, I'm alright. With that being said, the people I'm still going to see you guys for subscribing, and I'll see you guys next time. Cheerio! Not bad, but still though, is my luck ran out from celebrations, and this is my downfall for this month for July. Let's hope it doesn't happen. I like getting these, these are nice. I do have a few of the volumes are, but I'm sure they'll pop up right now. Ah! Ah!